Welcome to the channel, you guys. This is Ken, the Man Fishing, and today we're gonna to be doing a nice unboxing by Mystery Tackle Box, your March 2020 box. So let's go ahead and jump into it and see what we got inside. So first thing first, well, not really first thing first, but we got a nice cool sticker. It says, let's get it to zoom in, I guess. Too bright. Okay, but anyways, it says fish on with some knuckles on it, with like a catfish on it. So that's pretty nice. I'll add that to my tackle book bag. Then you got your tips and tricks a uh, little packet right here where you can if you don't know how to use a certain um bait that can't comes in your box you can always refer to this and that will show you how to do it then next we have a or next we have uh what's inside so i'm gonna go ahead and read off everything but you got your live target sunfish swim bait for 9.99 jenko fishing trap line rip knocker for 8.99 and lunker hat lunker frog for $8.25, Carl's Amazing Bait Spinner Bait for $5.99, a Northern Line Tackle Impulse Dipstick Stick for $5.79, and then your Hard Hat Jigs for $3.99, and Cream Lure Split Tail Trailers for $2.99. So we're gonna go ahead and jump into it. First, we got the um, first we got the live target swim bait right here, selfish, and you know. First thing, you know, I thought of when I got this, I was, you know, I was pretty happy. So I'm getting close. I might, might, I, I'm, I'm gonna say this real slow. Get uh, an April's box. I might get the bullshit. That would be so freaking cool if I can get it, but I don't know if it'll happen or not. But anyways, this color is considered natural blue pumpkin seed and it's a big old swim bait, four inches and one third and it's perfect for your pre-spawn and your spawn um, that's happening right now for the bass because bass love sunfish, bluegills, all that panfish. They're gonna be on their beds. They're going and these little fish are gonna be coming up to their beds, and then they're gonna be the bass are gonna be mad and then swipe at them. So bam, this is perfect for it. Nice color, natural colors to match the hatch, so it can't get no better than that. So next we got the. Jinko Rip Knocker. And this is this guy right here. Oh, also you guys, I forgot to say this, but if you can see this, I didn't take it out, but this hook is right behind the door front, the door fin, which will put, which will uh, act as a weed guard. So I like that, I really do like that. So pay attention to that, that was really nice. I like that mystery talk box, by the way. But this right here is the Jinko's Fishing Trap Line. And this is pretty much different. I'm gonna go ahead and take it out of the package. This is different from your standard uh, lipless cream bit. It doesn't come with the hooks on it already and it's only one, but it does come with a little small hole in it. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna line or you're gonna thread your, your line through it and then you're gonna tie off your hook right there. And what's that gonna do is, it's gonna do two things for you. It could help you get through cover and also it will help you for better hookup ratios. And what I mean by that is whenever your the bass hits this uh, lipless crankbait, what they tend to do is they use the lure as leverage and spitting the hook. So what with this not being attached to this this lure, it won't use the lure as weight for leverage to spit the hook. So that's very nice. I also got to pay attention to that. This is, uh, what is it? Um, what color? Citrus Shad. So it's really nice. I like it. Got a little trap in the inside. So I like that. Next, we got the Lunkers, the Lunker Hunt Lunker Frog. And I'm pretty excited about this guy also as well. It's more of a natural color. Let's go ahead and take him. Yeah, let's go ahead and take him out the package. See if we can't rip the package and open but anyways i was pretty excited about this because i ended up losing a, a frog that i used to have so this is my only frog now i get to add to the collection but this guy is very soft and i like the fact that his legs can extend so imagine you're just giving it a pop these legs are gonna you know kick off and look at that barely any movement and it's his legs are giving off action but also what i like is the hooks are, you know, pointing upwards, so that's gonna give it also a better hookup ratio. So that's very nice. And this color is considered uh, bluegill, so 
very good, nice to have. So natural, and it's also a natural color. So like I said, can't get no better than, than matching the hat. So, next, we got the Carl's Amazing Spinner Bait. Now, I'm pretty happy also about this guy or the spinner bait too as well because you know I only got like I think two spinner baits, so I actually need to stock up on spinner baits. So, but it's this guy, it's a half an ounce, comes with a mustard hook, so and it's chartreuse and white, and it comes with two different blade colors, gold and white. So you can't go wrong with a gold and white blade, gonna give off nice act nice action. So that's nice. Next, we got the Northern Land Tackle and Post Dipsticks. And these guys, let's open up. It's an eight pack as well, so it's, whew, it's definitely scented. Oh my goodness, man. It's definitely scented, but let's get for these guys. It's pretty soft. It's not, it's pretty scratchy as well, so, but it doesn't really, you know, really scratch, scratch. So these probably would, I'm not sure. These probably would tear a little bit easier compared to any other bait. But anyways, this is definitely good for, you know, wacky rig, Texas rig, Carolina rig. So you could use this for, for many uh, usage. So that'd be nice. Next, we got the hard hat jigs right here too. It's a four out hook and nothing too much with this one, but it, it, they are shaky head jigs jig heads so i'm not sure if i would be able to use this with this drop it down in the comment below if i would be able to i got it backwards but I, drop it down below in the comments or not if i would be able to use these for these dipstick worms so i'm not sure but maybe if i read my tips and tricks maybe it might tell me but last but not least you guys we got the cream lores split tail trailers but right here this is a nice all white they're pretty much thin and with this split, I'm sure, I'm sure they would give off some kind of action. So we're getting something out of it, but I'm not, I might, with it being so thin, I might be able to put this on the back of the spinner bait. I'm not sure, but I definitely would give it a try because I'm always a willing, I'm always willing to try new things, but. Okay. All right, so guys, that's the end of the video. That's all for this mystery tackle box unboxing, but Guys, I'm very happy with everything I got in this box this uh this month. But remember to give it a big thumbs up and drop a comment down below if you enjoyed your box or any questions about the things that I or uh, any questions about the lures that I got in my box or the tackle. You know anything that you guys want to ask me, drop it down in the comments below. I will answer back to them or any comment you want to give me. I will. I will respond back. So with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and leave also in the description, my link to where you can get your first mystery tackle box for $10. So remember to check out that and stay cool out there you guys. Stay catching the bass and peace.